Anglers from across the area headed out on Lake Bemidji Saturday to compete in the annual Knights of Columbus Walleye Classic, looking for the right five fish to take home the $12,500 grand prize. 100 teams of two took part in the event, which came right down to the wire. The leading team changed multiple times within the last five weigh-ins, with the very last team of Dean and Toby Kovalivog taking the crown and the check with a combined 17.6 pounds. But coming up to the scale, they didn't think they had a shot. Fortunately, I miscalculated a bit, and I figured we had 14 to 15, so I knew we had a shot at it. But then Chris Haley weighed in with uh, his partner, and, and it was 16-something, uh, and I thought it was lights out. We, we didn't have a chance, but fortunately, I underestimated, and we had big fish. Dean was set to retire from the event after this year, but he'll be back next year, hoping to become the first repeat champs of the Classic, a tournament he loves fishing in for a couple of big reasons. And what I like about it is, number one, it supports a lot of great groups in this community, which I'm in favor of, and number two, this guy here. <laughs> yeah, what a great event. Uh, 100 teams out there, a lot of community support, and as you saw there, it's just a, it's a great time to be out fishing with uh, whoever you're out there fishing with. Yep, uh, two great, uh, fantastic grand champions right there, the Kvalovog family, uh, Bemidji Staples, I'll say, but that's Columbus doing great work, and of course, you know, they do a lot of great, uh, host a lot of great activities and help a lot of organizations out. Yep, that was a big theme. Everybody, you know, they were talking about their fish, they are also talking about the great causes the tournament supports. Absolutely. Knights of Columbus, also known for the great footlong hot dogs. I gotta <laughs> throw that out there. <laughs> I'll, I'll introduce you at Walk Carmel. Thanks. <laughs> If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.